we love Guinness, Jameson, and Irish car bombs as much as the next person. So sometimes you need to elevate your St. Paddy's Day. So we have two lesser known Irish cocktails for you to enjoy. My name is Carl. And I'm Riley. And welcome to Alchemist, where we'll show you how to improve your home bartending skills. So on today's episode, we have two Irish cocktails you might not be familiar with. And we just found them out ourselves. I have what's called Wake Up Call. It's going to be a more dessert-based Irish cocktail. What do you have, Riley? I have the Declaration. Um, it is a very spirit-forward cocktail, and I'm really excited to try it. We recently collected five varieties of Jameson Irish whiskey for an upcoming tasting room episode. Since we have all of the surplus, I figured it would be fun to try a drink I'd never heard of using Irish whiskey. St. Patrick's Day is coming up. After searching through a few of the books we have, then turning to a Google search, I found The Declaration, which seemed like a whiskey cocktail I could enjoy. Of all the different whiskey varieties, Irish is one of my favorites because it's a little smoother and more mellow than the others, in my experience. So I figured I'd enjoy this spirit-forward cocktail more than a Manhattan or an Old Fashioned. The fact that we already had all of the ingredients to make the cocktail was a notable bonus. The most significant decision I had to make for this cocktail is which Irish whiskey do I use? I had five Jameson varieties, Powers, Three Swallow, and Finnegrins as available options. So I had to figure out which one would be best with the other cocktail elements. The cocktail starts with lemon and honey, which are perfect for tea or whiskey. Then dry vermouth, Angostura bitters, and orange bitters are added to balance and lengthen the cocktail. So Carl and I chatted for a bit about the best spirit options of the ones that we had available. Carl suggested using Jameson's Cooper's Crows because the prominent fruit and vanilla flavors would play nicely with the other ingredients. I don't usually like to admit when he's right, but he was this time. The cocktail was fresh and balanced. It wasn't overly boozy while still packing the punch I expected from a spirit forward beverage. The Declaration is a deliciously simple cocktail to build using just a few ingredients. Since I work at a brewery, I've been itching to try some beer cocktail recipes. I've tried a few in the past and I do enjoy the well-made ones. So I figured St. Paddy's Day would be the perfect occasion to try one at home for the first time. I'm not sure if there's a holiday that celebrates beer and liquor as much as this one does, at least in the United States anyway. I knew Guinness Extra Stout would be my beer choice because, well, it's Guinness. Yes, there are some fantastic red ales, but a stout just sounded better this time of year. It's warmed up a little, but we're not quite into spring yet. After 10 minutes of Google searches, I decided to make a dessert-based cocktail. A stout is always a great alternative to food or a spirit after dinner. I stumbled upon the Keg Works website with four different Guinness recipes, where I found Wake Up Call. Two things got me excited about this cocktail. One, we had all the ingredients and I didn't have to run back out to the store. Two, adding a coffee liqueur with cream of cacao sounds incredible with a stout. So I followed the recipe as instructed and was a little nervous to shake the beer in the tin. I was sure it was going to explode all over the place and leave a big mess. Luckily it did not. My first reaction to taking a drink was almost as if it was a beer milkshake. It was rich and sweet, just like you would hope. After trying a few more sips though, I decided it needs a few tweaks to match my palate. I think adding an entire egg would really elevate this drink and give it a creamy, smooth finish. I'll let you know what I find out. Give this original recipe a try. Let us know if you like it or if you think adding an egg would improve the cocktail. Thanks for joining us and watching our video for the declaration in the wake up call. We would appreciate a like and a subscribe to Alchemix. You can find more about each recipe on our website, alchemix.bar. Make sure you come back every Tuesday for a new recipe and every Friday for the tasting room. The world is your martini glass. Shake things up.